Donnie again with uh, Nautilus Net. Um, today I'm going to be going over um, a couple of common upgrades that we see quite, quite often. Um, uh, installing a 128 megabyte uh, battery back right cache enabler and also this is going to be in a DL380 G4 machine with dual procs, um, dual quad core pro or dual, dual core processors as well as four gigs of RAM. Um, also, I'm gonna be doing um, a, a fan kit install, which is all stuff that you guys should be able to do at home, no problem. Especially after watching this video, it's gonna be even easier. So, let's get to it. Um, first thing, first thing that I'm gonna go ahead and do on this is again, um, ideally, um, the people at home should have uh, ESD wrist strap, you know, connected to something metal, but in this case, um, it's going to be like how a person at home would do it. So I'm, I'm I don't have that. A, a good alternative to that is to again touch the chassis, make sure that your e your charge is equal to the chassis, and so yeah, that's the first step. And uh, of course, make sure everything is unplugged. Everything is unplugged. Um, it looks, it's looking great. Um, so again, we're going to go ahead and pull this PCI riser cage out of the machine, and it involves these two, th these two thumb screws here. And they actually, they look like that, but when you pull them up and twist, they stay up. So you're able to unscrew them just by hand. And if not, there are uh, T15 uh, Torx head, and that should work. And also, when you remove it, pull it straight up, it should pop right out, and set it off to the side for now. Not on the carpet, actually. Uh, make sure that it's on a hard surface so it doesn't pick up any ESD along the way. So, first things first, this, this is the memory module um, for the BBWC, which uh, is the battery back right cache um, and it's 128 and the spare number and everything matches the specs of this server so what I'm going to be doing actually another thing I need to do is lift these tabs up and pull the fan cage out like that because the wire is actually going to be routed underneath it and sitting here so it's pretty straightforward it's, it's really basically just like installing a large um, DIM or large uh, RAM so you, you line up the holes or you line up the slots push it in and you, you reach from it on this side and you make sure you put even pressure on both and it should snap in just like your RAM does and then this this wire here this is actually the battery this is actually the battery for this to um, remember the array, it, it keeps the array, um, you know, because this is actually uh, volatile memory, and with the battery, it makes it so it remembers it. So it's, it's it turns it actually into non-volatile memory. So, um, so yeah, we're just gonna route this wire along this black plastic thing that you see on the edge of the motherboard, and so the wire's routed, and then oh made a mistake actually um sorry guys i'm going to first things first i'm going to pull this out here and then i'm going to route it under here first like this because it wouldn't it won't fit so that goes under there and then this connector goes right back into here snicks in place and again, line the slots up, and then put equal pressure, snap. So now we're going to go ahead and do this again. Um, make sure that it's down there because the riser is going to go above it. So yeah, now what we do is, this is a bracket. This is actual bracket for this particular machine, and your and your 380 G4 should actually come with um, this exact same bracket. 
So, and I can't remember if it's this, I think it's this way. And it should snap and wait, maybe it's the other way actually. Let's see. Maybe it should snap in place like yay. And it should definitely be flush with the server so the lid can fit on. And any excess cable can just be tucked underneath this like that. So that's tucked in there. This is flush with the top of the server. So that is essentially installed. So next things, next what we're going to do is install this, reinstall this again. And that's just these two, these two metal things line up with this plastic here. 